the scene of today's crime is Euston Square Gardens, where these trees, can you please pan to the trees? Right, this camp here has been occupied from people from many different activist groups within London. People that I know who's here from, let's just say, Extinction Rebellion, but mostly a HS2 Rebellion. Uh, they're trying to stop these trees being pulled down. This company, this machine HS2, it's nasty. I've seen what the police have done to people, right? Do you know what I mean? Especially like Denham Country Park, man. I'm fucking to And Ro Roaldale Woods. What the fuck? HS2 is HS2, mate. I'll tell you, this company is nasty. They are brutal and they are backed by the police. If you don't pay the insurance, you've got no say. <sighs> My name's Sarah Jane Baker. I came out as trans in the male prison system many years ago. Up until 2019, I was the world's longest serving transgender prisoner. I was in prison for 30 years. I experienced on many occasions brutality from prison officers. And when I asked why they were hurting me, they would say, because we can. That damaged me, that damaged my mental health. And it also made me unreleasable because my experience of prison hardened my heart. Not just from the way I was treated by prison officers, but also the way that I was treated by many prisoners. Prisoners would spit on me on pretty much a weekly basis or throw cups of urine at me. Yeah, Grimfield, not forgotten. Coming out as trans in prison was not the wisest decision I've ever made in my life. But once you come out, you can't go back. <laughs> 